Hey everybody, it's John with Vinyl, and welcome to Five on Friday, where we take one album and we tell you five things you may not know about it. This week, the album is Bon Jovi by Bon Jovi. Here we go. Number one, this album was released on January 23rd, 1984, recorded at Power Station Studios in New York, where John worked, and which was also co-owned by John's cousin, Tony, who also helped produce this album. Number two, the first single, Runaway, was recorded by John with studio mu musicians because the band that you know and love as Bon Jovi was not formed until after the single was recorded and began to get some airplay. Number three, the first guitar player in uh, Bon Jovi's band before Richie Sambora joined was a guy named Dave the Snake Sabo, and Dave would later go on to form the band Skid Row. Number four, another musician who contributed to this album on both guitar and keyboards was a guy named Aldo Nova, who just a couple years prior to that recorded this song. Now, before I get to number five, I wanted to remind you that if you're interested in a framed copy of this album or any of the albums that we talk about on this channel, head on over to vinylly.com, V-Y-N-Y-L-Y.com. Take a look at what we have over there. If you're looking for something that you don't see, drop me a line and we'll try to find it for you. Okay, number five. The second single was a song called She Don't Know Me, and that is the only original song in the entire Bon Jovi catalog that was not written or co-written by a member of the band. That song was written by a man named Mark Avsek, who was in the band while Cherry and co-wrote some songs with Donny Iris. Now he's a law school professor. Thanks for watching this Five on Friday. If you enjoyed this, please remember to like and subscribe. And if I missed something on this list, feel free to let me know in the comments below. Mm -hmm.